Hey everyone, Joystick News here, and today we're jumping back into the wastelands of Fallout 76. Despite its resurgence and the booming player base, thanks to the new Amazon show boosting interest in the Fallout franchise, returning to Fallout 76 has proven to be a surprisingly tough challenge. Let's break down why this might be the hardest Fallout game to get back into, even for veteran players. Fallout 76's revival and current state. Right now, Fallout 76 is hotter than ever. It's experiencing a major resurgence with old fans revisiting and newcomers arriving thanks to the hype around the Fallout series. But here's the twist, despite all its updates and expansions, Fallout 76 remains a daunting challenge for returning players like myself. Challenges of re-entering Fallout 76 I recently decided to dive back into my old save from 2020 only to find myself completely overwhelmed. The game has undergone numerous changes and rebalances, leaving players like me disoriented. There's no refresher tutorial, no guiding hand to reacquaint you with its mechanics, and certainly no easy way to catch up on all the new content and updates. What's changed in the game? From new quests to overhauled mechanics, Fallout 76 has evolved significantly. The world is denser, more interactive, but also more demanding. Every skirmish felt like a brutal reminder of how much I didn't remember. My inventory was a mess, lacking essential items like stim packs and my old gear, not nearly as effective as I remembered. Starting over, unnecessary evil? After struggling to regain my footing, I faced a tough decision. Continue floundering or start fresh. Bethesda has added the option to start as a level 20 character, skipping the early grind. This feature is a lifesaver for those who want to experience the more advanced content without the initial slow pace. It's almost like they know returning players might need a shortcut. The MMO Challenge Remember, Fallout 76 isn't just an RPG, it's an MMO. This means engaging with a community in a shared world where every corner of Appalachia might hold new allies or enemies. It's about setting roots in a world that's constantly evolving, which can be a double-edged sword for those who leave and return. Conclusion, is it worth getting back into? Returning to Fallout 76 is like stepping into a familiar yet oddly foreign land. It's challenging, frustrating, but also intriguing. For newcomers buoyed by the series' renewed popularity or old players stirred by nostalgia, the question remains, is the journey back into the wasteland worth it? For me, starting fresh was the answer, but your mileage may vary. That's it for today's deep dive into the challenging world of Fallout 76. What's your experience been like? Struggling with the same issues or did you find another way? Drop your stories and tips in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more gaming insights. See you in the wasteland, survivors.